Alright, so look, yeah. main question is though Spring Break confession. What's the craziest thing you done for Spring Break or you trying to do for Spring Break? They had me a little sneaky link last night. I ain't even gonna count, but. That's is, that's is what it is. It's Miami. What? Like, what the f? We gonna do that and we gonna dip and go back home. What the f? Don't hit me up though. Like, don't text my phone when I get back to the crib because you gonna get blocked. Send this to someone who needs it. Hold this L. Like, no boy. One night only. Like, one night only. I'm from out of town. Customer service. Give me straight to the bitch, bro. Guys, three months later, some schmuck, some half a brain cell having dude who thinks he found something special gonna wife her up, bro. I promise you that, man. It's crazy. He's gonna be thinking that he found him a unicorn. You know, because he don't know no better. Like Corey Holcomb said, if you don't got a man in the house telling you that these women ain't shit, you're going to walk around blind. If ain't no man growing up in the house telling you them bitches ain't shit, you ain't going to know them bitches ain't shit till you damn near 40. Ain't that right? He ain't lying. Listen, I had to tell a family member of mine all that bullshit that your mama been telling you is wrong, and I refuse to let you end up with a woman like her. Straight up. I wouldn't be the type of family member I aspire to be if I didn't tell you that, because she gonna get you out here looking stupid, telling you that these women is perfect and that they deserve to be treated like princesses. If that's the case, why none of them been wiped up yet? Come on, bro. I went to the zoo with my homeboy. He forgot his wallet. I was like, oh, I got you. I paid to get in the zoo. I never knew the zoo was so expensive when you care for two people. <laughs> then, then when we get to the zoo, he get hungry. And I'm like, all right, yep. I gotta, okay, I'm gonna pay for the food too. But him, mm -hmm. man, he, he eat more than me. <laughs> so I'm looking at the menu. Yep. He ordered a, the big Whopper thing. I'm like, you don't want a salad? I paid for the taxi. I paid for us to do all that. Now this is my homeboy, he paid me back. Okay. But at, by the end of it, I was like, damn, if I was a dude, I wouldn't be taking girls nowhere. Well. Congratulations. Yeah, man. It's this much, but that's why I yep. appreciate when somebody do stuff for me and I don't just play like a lot of people go out with people and they mm -hmm. play with them. I don't play with you. You should have asked for his booty afterwards. I should have. You got me there? Yeah, that was her aha moment. She realized that her whole life has been a lie and she realized what men are actually up against. She dropped $300 or however much they said she dropped on a date and she probably expected a man to pay for it because, hey, she's a woman and even though he don't get no benefits of girlfriend or anything like that, he still is expected to pay. So guess what? She said, man, I wouldn't even be taking women on dates. Now y'all understand why so many men don't even want to date no more because if they got to spend money on a woman that is not even going to be worth the investment, they'll lose and out ultimately so i understand where a lot of these dudes are coming from if that nigga make you mad go to car gurus and type his number in you can put a random name act like you interested in like five cars that phone gonna blow up that night boom that phone gonna blow up the next morning watch what i tell you because tiktok didn't put me on but if he piss you off piss him off Y'all girl Mari, a side chick, she getting taken out on Saturday because on Tuesday, he gonna be with his real girlfriend. You mad as shit. I never knew my sister would be a side chick. Yeah, okay. Let me see. Side chick Mari. Mm, 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 mm. I was born a whore. Nasty bitch. Even if I didn't monetize my whore. I would want a partner who is like Literally. sexually open. Right, like. It just weeds out the haters. It's an evil world we live in. Just That's what I'm faster. saying. Yeah. yeah. So honestly, I don't really think that there are too many cons. I really feel like I was born for this whole shit. Like if we're being truthful and honest, a lot of women was born that way. They just won't admit it. This one only has two brain cells, so she don't know that it's to her detriment that she's telling the entire world this, right? And to her second point, she needs a man that's open-minded. She's looking for a beta. She's looking for a simp, a guy who's a freak, been addicted to pornography his whole life, and he's thinking that he's winning, but really he's losing ultimately because he's not going to be able to withstand watching a man plow his girl. A lot of guys go into that thinking it's going to be cool but until they see a dude putting their baby leg in their girl and then it goes downhill from there. But you should have never opened up Pandora's box to begin with, my boy. Don't let these women trick you out your position. They are master manipulators. They love to gaslight and they will make you feel less than a man because you're not strong enough to watch her go and do horrorish things. Most men always get looked upon like, like they're not a
Why is it different for women than it is for men? I'm a big player. Yeah. I'm a big done daughter. Because men and women are different. They and are. Because they are. Because it's easy for us to get sex. The world doesn't like think highly of you if you do what's easy. And men getting sex is hard. He ain't lying. So if they do what's hard, it's valued. If we do what's easy, it's not. You know, the top five to ten percent of men that are running through all of these women, right? Difference between them and the women who are getting ran through is that the women still want relationships from these guys. Those men don't want relationships from the women that are ran through. And that's why y'all are looked at like thoughts, because we're still valuable no matter how many women we slept with. There's always gonna be a woman that will look at us and be like, I don't care how many women he dealt with. I like this guy. No man, well, I can't go say no man, but the type of men that most women want don't respect women that got high body counts. It is what it is. I love when my hands smell like an eggplant after we're done. I feel sorry for your mother. Doing what we're doing. Mmm. Oh, it smells like his cologne too. He was so funny. Oh. It just, she belonged to the streets. <laughs> There's no way around it. A lot of these women are literally for the streets, bro. You cannot convince me otherwise, bro. They get on these apps and they just put it all on front street for you, man. I mean, and then the same girl would be like, I hate when a guy only wants sex from me. Come on. To me, that's all you got. You know what I'm saying? Come on now, dog. Come on, man. <laughs> say bro don't be dating these single mothers i'm telling you if you want your life to be like this go ahead on she got friends and stuff coming over i, I made a story about something similar to that <laughs> on my live the other day i took it down but bro i'm telling you these women will have dudes running in and out your house around your kids or her kids if you playing stepdaddy bro i suggest that you just don't do it I can't take no more. Man, I'm sick of these hoes. I'm so sick of these hoes. I can't take no more. I can't be a hero. I can't say these hoes. Real player like D-Rose. 